This is an interesting feature that I found this evening while browsing the uh, well Google Earth. I quite often use Google Earth as a tool in helping to look at uh, monuments and alignments uh, etc. So this is the Boyne Valley uh, in Ireland. This is Newgrange here. This is the uh, the Mound at Douth. Uh, this is Ballyboy Lake. Now it uh, largely dries up I think at certain times of the year. This image was taken, I presume this is American dating, so that's the 12th of July 2013. It's hardly December because there's a lot of vegetation. So this sort of semi, or sorry, quasi-circular feature, or almost circular feature, caught my eye at Ballyboy Lake. And I was having a look at it, and I was saying, well, you know, it could be just something that's maybe uh, just a coloration um, of vegetation. Um, this, I would say, is dried out uh, lake bed. Uh, uh, it's just muck, mud. Uh, perhaps this is a slightly raised area that just didn't get uh, didn't get covered by the water. But anyway, I I thought it would be at, at the very least worth uh, looking at. And then I looked at um, Flash Earth, which is associated with Bing, uh, Microsoft's uh, search engine. And the circular feature is also visible on their image. Um, now I think the, their image and the Google image are quite similar and were taken, I would say, at the same time of year, but uh, definitely at different times of the day. So if you look at, say, for instance, these trees in the corner, you see that the shadow is to the east of the trees in the Microsoft image, but it's to the west of the trees in the Google image. So. Uh, there are some subtle differences in the lighting and it's still visible as I say. It's also visible in Ordnance Survey imagery which you can get on the National Monuments uh, Service website um, which I think is very interesting. Uh, it's, it's it's quite visible there too. So it, it's, uh, it, it's in all three uh, Google Earth, Flash Earth and Ordnance Survey. So um, it could be nothing as I say it could be just a, an optical thing or a photographic thing but at the same time, there was, uh, not too long ago, uh, a Cursus uh, monument discovered in LiDAR imagery, which appears to lead roughly from Ballyboy Lake, this is Ballyboy Lake in the top left, to towards the Douth Mound, which is one of the three great passage mounds of the Boyne Valley, along with Newgrange and Nouth. Now, this is the LiDAR image of Ballyboy. Um, it's, I, I, I'm not an expert in reading LiDAR imagery, I have to admit, and uh, this isn't the highest resolution image either. I don't see anything there to excite me that much. Um, it's, 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 there's, you know, there, there's possibly something there, but I'd, I'd need archaeologists and experts in the field uh, to take a closer look at that uh, in higher resolution uh, to maybe... Um, uh, you know, give us an expert opinion as to whether it might be something and whether it might be worth uh, further investigation.